First for me, so y'all gonna have to have to pray with me as we do this. Uh, Come on, Pastor. Yeah, I want to say thank you for the opportunity. Uh, I had something broke down that I had been working on, but uh, we're just gonna do something else. We're just gonna vibe with the environment and see what God tell us to say. Yeah, that's right. Oh, uh, we're gonna call this. Um, there's a reason why he can't put a ring on. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Whoa. Uh -oh. There's a reason why he can't put a ring on. Over in Genesis, God sat down and he made a decision. He sat Adam next to that, he sat Adam next to him, and he decided to give him vision. The first thing that he told him to do is he gave him a job. But most men these days, they don't want to work. So how it is, is my women, we celebrate you tonight, but if a man is good enough to sweat on you, he ought to be good enough to work for you. Yeah. Oh. That part. But here we are, and all the time that we give, God took Adam, and he only took one rib. And he took one rib, and he made woman. But the problem with man is, is that they've given out all of their ribs and now when it's trying to find the right woman, they have nothing to hold up. Leaving them spineless and leaving them with nothing to hold up their insides. There's a reason why he can't put a ring on it. But yet here we are, here we are, here we are. We keep trying to force relationship after relationship after relationship. But uh, when God gave man vision, uh, that means that he gave a man a project. But the problem is men don't know how to use women for help me, so she has nothing to work on. Come on, brother. A man, uh, a woman gets frustrated with a man that has no vision. He can't lead in his household. He can't make decisions. Mm. Come on. So here we are, here we are, trying to give the woman a chance. But we're mad at the man because the woman wears the pants. Come on now. But it's not his fault. It is his fault that he can't put a ring on it. Here we are as men, we get papers on our dogs, we get papers on our cars, but we won't give a woman a contract. But we'll lay down with him because we want the contact. Come on. There's a reason why he can't put a ring on it. Here we are enjoying the feeling but not wanting the responsibility. There's a reason why he can't put a ring on it. You must run a check before you decide to contaminate your spirit. Because here we are, we should be depending on G-O-D, but here we are contracting these STDs, these spiritually transmitted diseases. Come on, brother. Oh. So here they are now, uh, running around like uh, cows grazing on contaminated land. They uh, end up uh, messing up the milk and the meat. Yes. Mm. Why buy the cow when you can get everything for free? Mm. Uh, they treat it like bluebell. They eat all they can and sell the rest. <laughs> Come on, man. There's a reason why. Wow. There's a reason why. There's a reason why he can't put a ring on it. And lastly. The awesomeness and our God, the awesomeness is when he made woman, he made woman out of the side of a man. And that's where she ought to be, but we don't, we, will, we won't give the woman a look. If God desired for woman to be underneath us, he would have made her from out of our foot. There's a reason why. There's a reason why. There's a reason why he can't put a ring on. Okay. Thank you.